lot to talk about mary thanks a tragedy in pueblo as a woman is found dead after a fire inside an abandoned home early this morning news channel 13's dan Beatty joins us from the scene on the city's east side with more on what happened there dan bart the idea of the female victim is still unknown the cause of this fire is still unclear but directly behind me is the home where or the property where the fire occurred earlier this morning this house is barely visible from the street lots of bushes lots of shrubs in the front yard neighbors uh, could actually smell the fire before they saw any flames just a lot of smoke coming out and we thought we heard somebody run off. Just past 2 Tuesday morning, neighbors called 911 reporting a fire at this property on the 1200 block of Catalpa Street. Firemen entered the home and made a gruesome discovery. Uh, extinguishes the fire. They locate a uh, female, uh, deceased female in the house. It's unclear how long the woman was inside the abandoned home. Others may have been in the home when the fire first ignited, but there is no clear sign of foul play at this time. There was nothing like super obvious on her body to indicate, you know, this or that. So that's why we're kind of in a holding pattern till the autopsy is done. I basically lived here. Craig grew up here. After the early morning fires were put out, Renee Mestis stepped inside of the home she grew up in for the first time since her grandmother passed away several years ago. That was my grandma's room right there. Seeing the charred remains of her childhood home only brings pain. What do you think? I'm in distraught. I can't believe it. I would never think this would, house would go up. And look like this? It didn't look like this at all. Now, Mistis tells me that this house has st stood abandoned since 2014. Uh, we're waiting on word from the county coroner regarding the ID of this uh, fatal victim. Reporting live in Pueblo, Dan Beatty, KRDO, News Channel 13. All right, Dan, thanks. A two-alarm fire on Arcadia Street kept fire crews in northern Colorado Springs busy this morning. It broke out in the laundry room of the Kitty Hawk apartment.